this is a what collectors call a World War II Russian marksman's badge, but its name is the Vorishilov Marksman of Osovayakim badge. Um, formed in 1927, the Osovayakim, which is an abbreviation, um, it, its real name was the Union of Societies of Assistance to Defence and Aviation Chemical Construction of the USSR. Basically, it was a kind of... Um, how can I describe it? A voluntary assistance organisation to the Russian Army, Navy and Air Force. But it became so huge, it became its own organisation. And the people that were in it were issued with badges and then, then when they went into the regular Army, Navy and Air Force, they retained the badges. So this will be worn by a member of the organisation that passed a marksman course and then when he went into the Red Army, he would have worn it on his tunic to show that he'd been on the course. It's kind of unfair to try and put it on a par with the wartime German Hitler Youth, but it's not really a youth organisation, it's more like a reserve organisation. And it was formed in 1927, and it brought together the kind of reserve organisations of the Russian Army, Navy, and Air Force all together under one banner. And by 1941, there was 13 million people in it. And some of them got this marksman's badge. And there's four, uh, I think there's four types of the badge. Um, there's this one, there's another one with a Roman numeral one in the middle. And I think there's one with a Roman numeral two in the middle. So I think there's only three badges, not four. So this is the marksman's badge of the organization. And um, it's also called the the Russian Army Marksman's Badge, because you see it on army tunics, World War II pictures, things like that. But it's actually a, a pre-army organisation Marksman's Association Badge. Really nice thing, brass, enamel, standard screw back. Some will be makers numbered across the bottom, some won't be. It's a really nice badge. So that's what you would see on all the kind of World War II photographs of Russian Army marksmen. This just shows he's been a member of that kind of reserve organisation. And he's passed a marksman's course. He's wearing the old pattern uniform with the Nagant rifle with his bayonet on the end of it. So a really nice badge. So that's the, for want of a better word, the World War II Russian Army Marksman's Badge.